Hello, I'm Mike, and I'm here to talk to you about the tuba. The tuba is a large brass instrument in the brass family of instruments, and it provides the bass for the band. We need lots of tubas, and it's a lot of fun. The tuba is part of the brass instrument family, which is, yes, they are made out of brass, but the main thing is how you make your sound. What you do is you have to buzz your lips. In other words, if I just blow air in the tuba, nothing happens. Well, then somebody says, well, Mike, you're not moving those buttons. Still nothing happens. What you've got to actually do is make a vibration with your lips like this. Then you do it into the mouthpiece, which is a cone-shaped piece of brass. And then you put it all in the tuba and you get sound. Okay? So it's all about buzzing of your lips. Um, the tuba, like I said, provides the bass for the band. It's a whole lot of fun. You get to play a lot of fun songs. So here are some bass lines you might have heard on the radio. I hope you will consider playing the tuba, but primarily I hope you will consider just being in the band. The band is a wonderful experience for you. It's a great way to use your creative brain on a busy school day of using your mathematical and science brain. You make friends, deeper friends than you would, I'm gonna just say in math or science class. You get to have shared experiences. You're learning things together for the first time. You have a chance to make music. As much as we love to listen to music, there's no substitute for being the person making the music. You don't have to have any experience. Your band teacher will teach you everything you need to know. Tuba can be for everyone. One of the best in the world who is in the Philadelphia Orchestra is a young lady who won the job when she was 20 years old. So don't let the, your gender decide what you should play or not play. I've been playing the tuba around 40 years or so now, and it has taken me far. It helped me pay for my college. I met my wife in the band. I got my job from band. I did all kinds of traveling and touring and great experiences. I've played for 5,000 member crowds. I've done all sorts of things with band. Now, I will tell you that band does not have to be that deep for you to still be worthwhile doing. You still can have a lot of fun, um, breaks up your academic day, gives you a chance to understand music better. Every time you walk into a movie theater after you've had band, you will hear things differently. You will start to hear French horns soaring out of the soundtrack. You will start to hear trumpets. You will start to hear cellos that you never noticed before, and you will just enjoy the experience in a much deeper and richer way. So I think you should say yes to band. So some of you might be saying, but Mike, the tuba is gigantic. Well, mine is, but I'm a professional player. You're not required to play one that large. Most middle schools, beginner band programs, have a smaller tuba like this that still plays all the same notes as my big tuba, but it's much easier to handle. It's smaller, lighter, still plays all the same notes, and it's a great instrument to start on. So don't let the size of the tuba scare you. You will most likely have one closer to this size than this size. To play the tuba in most places, the school owns the tuba. They are very expensive in most cases, and so you would generally just need to get your own mouthpiece. We have those at Arts Music Shop. We have locations in Birmingham, Dothan, and Montgomery, but we cover many, many other areas around um, multiple states that we bring the store to you. Think about Arts Music Shop for all of your musical instrument needs.